Uh, ben, that fire has grown to over 100 acres, I'm told by officials who we just spoke to a couple minutes before we came live here on Fox 61 News starting at 5. But I do want to urge everyone that officials do say that this fire is contained, but they have issued a smoke alert as because they're doing what's called a burnout, which is what you see behind me. I want to show you all what we're looking at right here on scene. Um, and you can see right now that the flames are still going on from the burnout, which they're doing to attempt to slow down the fire that has spread out here at the Notchacug uh, State Forest. And we did hear back from officials say that, say that right now they have personal location in the wooded area between Route 203 and Harbor Freights, where the flames have charred, you know, around 100 acres of land. Officials say this fire is located deep in the Notchacug State Forest near the airline trail where it sparked Wednesday. Earlier this morning, Deep brought some heavy machinery near the fire to do a burnout in an attempt to put the fire out. And as you heard earlier, this fire has caused North Wyndham Elementary to close, which is about half a mile or so from the fire line. A fire official say this is nothing compared to the wildfire seen out west, but with the ongoing drought, it's still better to be careful rather than sorry. Fire is fire wherever you are. Um, it's the fuels that drive and the weather that drives a fire. So the fuels here are all receptive because of the amount of dryness. But if you look around here, there's a lot of deciduous forest and those leaves are still green, but we're coming into that time of the season when those leaves are gonna start falling. Time-wise, we got really lucky with this fire because those leaves are still on the tree. And if we get some rain to do a full extinguishment on this, we're gonna be pretty good. Now, officials have set up what's called a fire watch as they monitor the flames here seen uh, in North Wyndham. Now, officials do want to remind everyone that do not do not call 911 unless you do see flames because they have the situation under control. But for now, we are live in North Wyndham. Brian Ditlake, Fox 61 News.